No, I just watched this guy go up the, okay, so he just jumped off this little L-shaped platform into lava, and now he's swimming around in the lava, and then he just went up the lava, uh, waterfall, and there goes my grandmother again. Hang on. So, as, as I was saying, the, uh, the magma was on this little L-shaped island, and he jumped off, and there's a fucking gas right there. Oh my god. No, 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 I'll just go in circles here. Go away, 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 go away. And, uh, he goes swimming around in the... He's swimming around in the, uh, in the magma, and then all of a sudden he goes up the lava falls. And he jumps out of the lava falls, back into the magma, and is swimming around again. It was, it was quite majestic. Mm -hmm. Hello everyone, this is Unalia, and welcome back to Rainbow Harvest. <laughs> I just logged in. Um, so yesterday, I did some, some work. Uh, actually, I went on a a wonderful trip with Crumus and we went searching for treasure as you can see there's two that are missing and my own my very first treasure map um so that happened and uh, I'm gonna be doing some things around this base and I hope y'all enjoy this video so I'll see y'all in a bit. I am finally getting on up in the world. <laughs> uh, I have finished my nether tunnel. I not really finished it. It's It goes to the place that I want it to go. And it is ready to, to be, you know, used as safe travel. So that's a, that's a thing. And, uh... So, um, I had to get Chromis to help me with that, and a lot has transpired in the past couple of days. Um, me and Chromis have been talking a lot about things, and um, everything is going, going very well. <laughs> so... Um, I am going to go visit my mom tomorrow uh, to talk to her about moving back home again and like I haven't talked to her like this over and over again <laughs> uh, my mom is really she's a bitch like she wow that almost went over my head she really is, uh, and she's been constantly trying to punish me for a while now, for the decision I made, and what I did, and everything. I know, Sid, I know. Or you just might want a tater tot. Do you want a tater tot with, with ketchup? Don't get ketchup on the floor, you dog. Silly thing. Anyways, uh, now that I'm in a better mood, I'm going to be ripping up all of this diorite. And uh, I'm not going to have any other trails or anything like that. I have changed my mind about everything. So there's not going to be these these walls right here. There's not going to be like large walls going anywhere. There's not going to be pathways. It's just going to be a big ha big building basically of glass and whatever the heck I feel like having. So um, I'm going to be tearing everything down. And I'm going to be building a wonderful looking house-like place.
place <laughs> is the best thing that I can explain. Um, I think the reason why I like the cotton candy type of house type of deal so much is because it's so colorful and it's bright. And when they came out with um, with diorite, it just made everything so much better. So I'm going to be doing this out of diorite and I'm going to be doing the cotton candy build uh, with a bunch of glass and it's going to be panes, it's going to be glass blocks, it's going to be like Oh my god, it's going to be rectangles, it's going to be circles, it's going to be like everything. Just, it's going to be all over this, this island. You're going to have grass, basically. I'm, I'm going to keep some areas grass and some areas not so much grass. Um, Sidian, stop it. And I'm, I'm just going to have a lot of fun with this. What was that? Someone shut a door or something. But uh, this is what I've been wanting to do, and I am happy that I, I finally come to the decision that I have, and um, things are kind of falling into place again, so, well, halfway through they are. <laughs> so, um, I guess you can say I'm I'm really happy. I'm generally happy now. So anyways, uh, I'm going to s fast forward through some of this and we're going to- would you hush? HUSH! Sorry. I'm going to get some of this uh, taken down. So yeah, I'll see y'all in a bit. Hi guys, I'm back again. Sorry about that. Wouldn't it be great? I was listening to some music while I was doing all that, so um oh hey, my carrots and potatoes that I that I planted are done. Yay, oh crap. Well, they're kinda done. <laughs> so um let me get all these carrots and potatoes up. The weight's all done, the uh, <coughs> pumpkins are done, alright, so um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get a ton of dirt and I'm going to level this off. I'm going to level everything here. Um, there's not going to be a low spot in here, um, I'm, I'm just going to level everything. So I'm going to chop down the trees uh, and I'm going to turn up some dirt turn up some dirt, put down some dirt, <laughs> and uh, we're going to get everything level and flat again. So, yeah. Hopefully, Turtle, you have been there for ages now, and that grass is still floating after all these episodes. <laughs> Amazing. So, yeah.
I'm currently drinking some juice uh, because I'm kind of tired of drinking soda and yeah let me get this stuff in their own places my inventory is so full just so full of things okay um, I need to find another place for all that nether rack stuff yeah alright let me get underway with the the soil placing I'll be right back I am currently in spawn. Um, I was helping uh, Deso last night with digging and I have a ton of stone and iron picks. So that's what I was doing yesterday. Um, I also had 30 something levels and I lost all due to being killed, I think by a creeper or a spider or no. Enderman. I died to an Enderman. <laughs> so that that happened. But uh, I have done some changes. Spawn is slowly changing. Like the Falcon Blade was working on the portal last night. Looks really good. I like it. Um, and over here, this is Deso's place. We had a creeper explode over here in a couple places. Dessa's place is really, really... Like, there's a ton of torches everywhere, but it's still really dangerous. So, this is his little lake house. It's really adorably cute. I love it. <laughs> he builds such cute things. Up here is his balcony and his bedroom. He's got nice... He could have gone upwards with that, that glass... But, you know. Um, it's cute. And over here is his wheat or potato farm or something. I think wheat. Um, and more wheat. And then over here is... Oh my god. I didn't know he made this many chests. <laughs> this room used to not be so cluttered, I swear. But this is his storage and work room. And over here <coughs> is the hole 
that he's digging. He's done a good bit of more work, actually. So, I see he's mining a little bit here and there. Going, oh, okay. Did he find... Did he... <laughs> I guess those are like mined out pockets of stuff. I don't really know, but... Oh, this might have been gravel or something. I think that was gravel. Oh, yeah, he had coal. So he says that there's a mob spawner somewhere underneath him at times when he's digging because he keeps hearing mobs like spawn and stuff. Oh. Okay. Um, but yeah, this is going to be a 50 by 50. He's slowly bringing it down. It's uh, it's quite the uh, quite the thing to do. So yeah. Well, anyways, um, I don't know how long I've been recording for. This is a couple of days later from when I was doing the base. Uh, I took some time off from the base to get ideas. And, um, so yeah. I just came out here to chill and relax and spawn. See all the changes that's happened in it. Not much. Not much at all. Um... Um, anyways, so I will let y'all go, and I'm going to head back home and get things dealt with, and probably build a little bit more on, on my house, and yeah, until then, I will see y'all later. Bye guys. Oh! Hi, check. <laughs> Just zooms right in. Huh. Oh. Tag. 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 I'm rather confused. Very confused. Did I just get tagged? <laughs> See you later. Until next time. Bye, guys.